What a beautiful Air France A350 behind me. The first Air France A350 has been named City of Toulouse. I'm extremely proud to fly this aircraft all over the world for Air France. I make two records on this flight myself. How's it going? Oh my gosh, I am shell shocked. <laughs> Jumping for everybody on the Air France. Cheers. Hundreds of staff waiting at the Air France headquarters. You can tell the left hand side of the aircraft all the Air France staff welcoming us. Very nice stair. Today I'm at the Airbus Delivery Center taking the first Air France A350. We are the only airline in the world uh, who have operated every model of commercial jetliners that Airbus has produced, starting with the Airbus A300, the A310, the A320, A330, A340, A380, and now the Airbus A350. So by the end of this year, we'll have three a350 uh, 300s in the fleet. Uh, we'll have three more by uh, the summer of next year. And then we take uh, 11 additional aircraft by the end of 2021. And we'll have all 28 aircraft delivered before the end of 2025. This aircraft ferry to Charles de Gaulle, we will partly use biofuel. And this illustrates the importance of this level for, in the, for the industry. Minus 25% CO2 emissions. Uh, its average consumption is only 2.5 liter per passenger and per 1,000 kilometer, and the noise footprint will be reduced by 40 percent. The 7th of October, first commercial flight of the Airbus 350, it will be the 86th anniversary of Air France. Uh, so the Hippocampele, so the winged seahorse, uh, is a distinctive uh, history symbol of Air France. It appears on the winglet of this uh, beautiful aircraft and also on the engines. In the winter season, uh, 27th of October, it will fly to Toronto. Then when we receive the third aircraft, it will fly to Cairo and Seoul. What a beautiful Air France A350 behind me. They just reviewed the first Air France A350 has been named City of Toulouse. Welcome on board to the brand new Air France A350. Today's delivery flight is a little different. There's a lot, a lot of people joining. I was told over 250 guests. Um, I think there are a lot of staff for Air France. They want an internal competition and their prize is to come to take delivery of the first A350 back to Paris. Hello. Hello, sir. Hello. Hello. Here's. Thank you. You want to see the same A? Thank oh, you, sir. you're very stylish with the red uh, <laughs> yeah. letter. Okay. All right.
look at the business class seats or direct aisle access. I love the fabric here, the leather and the fabric. Just like Air France, very chic, very nice design. And it's very, very clean as well. Uh, the seat designs all staggered. So um, the middle aisle seats face a little bit diagonal. Um, the pair seats face straight. How are you? Fine and you? Yeah, good. How do you found the seat so far? Very comfortable, very easy to, to, to put in bed, or very clean. And very clean, yes. Yes, very clean. Look after the window. Oh, very nice. electric window. So beautiful. Oh, new generation. New yes. generation. Wow. Um, so big. Very big. Very big. So Kevin, how do you like your business class seat? Oh, it's very nice business class. I really enjoy it. This is the new generation yeah, for Air France. Yeah, the leather is very clean. The atmosphere is very great. I envy you. You have a business class seat. I have a premium economy today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not lucky, but you will do it uh, next time. Next I'm time. Sure. <laughs> Enjoy your flight. Thank you, you too. <laughs> I'm just trying out this economy class seat. This is 16 C. This seat has a little bit extra leg room here, as you can see. And it's surprisingly, you think it's narrow, but I actually think it fits me perfectly. first flight, this delivery flight. Uh, so we're now in Toulouse on course to Paris Charles de Gaulle uh, with this brand new A350. Uh, today we'll be flying at flight level 350. It's normal because we're in A350. And uh, it will take us one hour to reach Paris uh, with a fuel consumption of 6.2 tons of petrol, uh, which is very low. This type of aircraft um, is um, very low in fuel consumption, about 25% less than previous generation of aircraft. And uh, I would say that um, its uh, environmental signature, when we speak about noise, is 40% under the previous generation of aircraft. So this makes, uh, I wouldn't say a green aircraft, but presently this may be the best aircraft we can have to, to do the job. And I'm extremely proud to fly this aircraft all over the world for Air France. Uh, Captain, I heard today's flight is also powered by biofuel. Yes, this is it. Yes, today uh, we have an experiment. Uh, half of the fuel we have on board is biofuel. Today is the shortest delivery flight in the world, probably. One hour to Paris. I'm sitting in premium economy. We don't need business class. But Sam, um, of course we need a business class for one hour. Everything is just so new on this plane and uh, I think I'm the first one to sit here, first one to open the table, first one to use the IFE screen. To evacuate the aircraft, follow the illuminated path, s'attache et se détache de cette façon. Prends le masque pour libérer l'oxygène. Place the mask over your nose and mouth. Captain, so we're on the runway ready to go, but unfortunately the aircraft which had just landed has uh, performed a bird strike and so I want a runway check before we may go for obvious uh, safety reasons. So this operation we got five minutes, I thank you for understanding. Ooh, this is pretty close from the captain's announcement. There's a bird strike on the airplane landing before us. So fingers crossed, um, hopefully it will be smooth.
to know, um, I've been sitting here during the flight and this is a recliner seat. This is a different seat to your premium economy in other planes, which is a fixed shell. Yes. So why are you now chosen to have this kind of seat? It's another kind of comfort. Please recline in your seat. Recline. Yeah, perfect. Oh, yes. Yeah. I see the nice lighting just yeah, came up. Yeah, exactly. The light in this aircraft is very, very important. It's good comfort, yes. Yeah, and you have a good cool front, even in the shoulder. So it's really... Even in the shoulder. Yeah, it's really good. The cool front that you can feel and your body mm. with the recliner seat, that's a relaxed position. I actually felt I'm relaxed. I'm relaxing too much. I'm reclining too much. <laughs> Champagne for everybody today on today's flight. <laughs> but we always have champagne on every flight on Air France, even in economy class. But what, today... What is the champagne name here? Champagne Tieno. Champagne Tieno. Everyone come to my window, take photos there, because the view in English we call this... Um, the logo Air France is the winged seahorse. Yes. It's a seahorse. Um, but how do you call this in France? In it's, French? Yes, in French we say hippocamp. Hippocom. Yes, Hippocom. Thank you very much. Thank you. Champagne for everybody on Air France. Cheers. Very rarely there's an airline CEO so down to the earth. He come over to every passenger. Are you Canadian? I, yes, I lived in Canada for 43 years. I was actually born in the UK, but I spent most of my life in Canada. This is, uh, you know, the first new uh, Airbus long haul airplane in Alphonse in a long time, uh, and as you can see, it's fantastic. I love the way you said about bringing the tradition back to Air France. Bring the seahorse, the winged seahorse, which I'm seeing see right, here. right here. I can see it right out here. So um, I got it right here on my tie. On your tie. Oh, yeah, look at that. So this is what, what's called in French the hippocamp. Stylish. I hope really one day you turn around Air France, and because there are lots and lots of fans like myself. We love Air France. Oh, we love the gastronomic, you. we love the comfort and the chic, okay. and we hope Air France will become a formidable European carrier. You like French butter? Of course. You like French chocolate? I love everything. You like French All bread? the food made in French. Like wine? <laughs> we already started our descent. records on this flight myself. Uh, the first record is this is the shortest delivery flight just one hour and also the second uh, record is there's almost 300 people every seat is filled so um, Air France used this good opportunity to showcase their product to the staff and industry professionals. That was amazing. There were literally hundreds of staff waiting at the Air France headquarters. They're standing on the rooftop the next to the fence, welcoming this new airplane. Bye. Goodbye, sir. Bye. Such a pleasure to see you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Did you enjoy? Oh, of course. Yeah, Thank you so nice. much. <laughs> Nice to see you. Yes. 
Beautiful. Yeah, thank you. Oh my god, that was super nice. What a beautiful welcome to Paris. Hey. Hey, Mr. San Chewy. How was your flight? Nice. Good flight. See you, Sam. See you next time. Yeah. Bye bye. Well, I didn't expect this. That was a grand welcome. Look at these ladies holding Air France. Welcome, Airbus 350. I hope you like the video. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.